You made a wise decision to examine the one as Pentecostal doctrine by attending a service, rather than assuming without exposure. A few thoughts. Baptismal regeneration. Salvation through baptism alone goes against the clear teachings of scripture that salvation comes by grace through faith, not works like baptism. F2, 8, 9. Using the Ethiopian eunuch story in Acts to support this is a stretch, as the passage doesn't explicitly state baptism granted salvation there. It was part of his conversion, not the cause. Most mainstream Christian denominations reject modalism one is as it compromises the distinct personhood of the Trinity, Father, Son and Holy Spirit. You were right to be skeptical of a pastor twisting scripture to fit their theological system rather than letting scripture interpret itself plainly. Continuing contact despite differing strongly on pivotal doctrine like salvation undermines the integrity of both parties' convictions. You demonstrated maturity by thoughtfully considering their position through direct experience, yet maintaining your own beliefs when the teaching conflicted with scripture. That's a balanced, discerning approach. Your faith isn't swayed by superficial appeals or pressures.